so for example you have this buffer internally the buffer is nothing it is this particular buffer it's nothing but a combination of two inverters okay so it is like two back to back inverters that is connected over here that basically forms a buffer over here so now let's uh, let's look into one uh, into the characteristics of one of the inverters and that and, and that particular characteristics can be expanded to a buffer or can be expanded to any circuit so let us let us try to look into the basic uh, uh, characteristics of this small inverter if we expand this inverter so i should have expanded it only for this inverter but let us try to look into uh, the buffer as a whole and and the inverter as a single element over here so we are looking at an inverter over here inverter has got a pmos at the top and nmos at the bottom this is a very famous structure that uh, we uh, we have seen for an inverter circuit so the first kind of power let let us try to look into what happens uh, what happens in this scenario so when the when you see at the input input moves from logic 1 to logic 0 when when it is at logic 0 your pmos turns on your nmos turns off